Looking for the best in African entertainment? The African Movie Revolution is on at AparivoMovies.com. If you enjoy action, adventure, romance, comedy, horror, <laughs> suspense and drama, musicals and family films, visit AparivoMovies.com, where you'll find premium African movies in all these genres and in all these languages. English, French, Swahili, Yoruba, Lingala, Hausa, and Twi at AfarivoMovies.com. The African movie revolution is on. Waiting of royal throne of Hayana. Born on the glorious morning that began the glorious age of Hayana. The damsel whose birth ended Hayana's years of misery and set forth prosperity. Peace and joy, a national treasure, the future queen, the damsel whose only wish is to visit the land of her ancestors. She knew her origin is from Africa and chooses to kiss its soil before her marriage and coronation as the Queen of Hyana. Welcome to Ghana Latifa. Welcome to Africa. 
the land of your ancestors. Your decision to pay homage to the land of Africa from where your ancestors were taken is a real noble one. Your desires will be fulfilled. We shall make sure you have a very wonderful heat free stay. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you very much. I am indeed very happy to be here. The hospitality from the airport to this place has been tremendously awesome. The picture they paint of Africa and all the parts of the world is so different from what I see here so far. I hope to enjoy my little stay here and then take you all back with me to the Caribbean island of Hyena for my marriage and coronation. Sure. <laughs> Thank you very much. Walk this way, this way. I have pleaded with you to tell me whatever it is. As the saying goes, a problem shared is half solved. Wendy, this tour guide agency thing is not working for me. I can barely make an income or even feed myself. I haven't paid you in three months. I don't even know where my next income is going to come from. But I'm not complaining. That doesn't make it right. I should be paying you for working for me, not you taking full stuff from your mother's place to feed me. Whatever I do, I do from my heart. I came here to work and earn money. And I met a struggling boss and a struggling agency, but I'm not walking away. I'm going to continue cooking for you as long as my mom gives me food. Hoping that one day this place will pick up. Look, Wendy, the truth is this agency has no future. I love this talk I job so much. That is why I studied history and anthropology in school. But I now discovered that I was wrong about the choice of profession. I'm in debt. I'm in a hopeless situation. Show guide agency has to be closed out. I'm sorry. No, the Sean Tor agency can never close. It can never close. It's already been closed. I was just thinking of a way to inform you. What? Hello? It's for you. Hello? Yes, yes, your mesa here. Yes, the best tour guide around. I have all the destinations in my palm, sir. Yes, yes. I know everywhere like the back of my hand, sir. Yes. Okay, sir. Okay, okay, okay. All right, thank you, sir. Thank you. Now? Okay, okay. Thank you. Can you believe it? It's a call for a big job. Oh my god, and, and guess what? The call came from the whole Max Hotel. I'm meeting somebody very important and I'm going to be the tour guide. Who to ever sent my information to them must have been divinely sent. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Oh, God. Okay. Last. I did. Yes. You did what? I did. I sent them the information and I sent the same information to five star hotels in Ghana and other traveling agencies. I knew this day would come <laughs> and I'm glad it did. <laughs> here by now. I called your office and they told me you had left long ago. And they, they, they gave me your mobile number. Say, say, I'll, I'll be there very soon. It's just that my means of transport is... Um, um... Ah. Are you not coming in your company car? Or a taxi? 
I can hear you breathing heavily. What, what is going on? <laughs> sir, sir, what I'm using is, is faster than any taxi or, or, or car, please. I'll, I'll be there in a jiffy. to me every time for me to relax my princess it is my duty and that is you know why. your resilience is very staunch listen what we need to do is to go out visit all these memorable places meet new people not do the same old routine i've done all my life i guess i should leave you my lady excuse me my lady Anna? do you think i'm making the right decision by marrying gray of course, my lady. Kure is a very handsome man, and the throne is your bed, right? Is there any other thing you know of Kure except the fact that he's handsome? Oh, uh, no, my lady. Hello, sir. Look, mister. Top on her agenda is to see people and places in Ghana. Where the hell in Accra are you coming from? And how many years will it take you to get here? Sir, sir I'll be there very soon, okay? I I'm just a pull away. I am only contracting you because my first arrangement failed. And then also because you indicated in your proposal that your agency runs 24 7. And that you had all the facilities and the manpower to run this business. What is happening? No, no, no. I'm, I'm the right man for the job, sir. Please. Yes, sir. I'm, I'm coming, sir. No, no, don't give the any. Don't, don't give the job to anybody, please. I beg. Listen, like I told you, you don't even need any vaccination. Yeah, don't worry. When I come, you can see the pictures. Spare me all the talk, right? I'm really not in the mood. Okay, fine. Sure. Talk later. Hello? Sir, I, I, I'll be there soon, sir. I'm, I'm almost there. I can, I can see the building, sir. I'm coming, sir. I'm coming. Okay, sir. Ah. Hello? Hey! Put that damn thing down and stop there! Two hundred meters away from where you are standing is my domain. I haven't caught any thief overnight. Don't bring yourself. Officer in charge. Uh -huh. Look, I'm already late. I have to be with the manager right now. I have to take care of the important guests who just arrived. Please.
taking care of who? Do you know who she is? Do you even know where you are? Please, madam. The manager is making the arrangements. We'll get back to you very soon. That is all right. Yes, sir. Um, she wanted to know the program she is attending this evening, the dress code and the time as well. Look, call all our links. Check the internet for any event that is taking place in the city tonight. Music, music, a stage drama in the National Theatre, jazz, whatever, anything at all. I'm not waiting for that moron anymore. I am in this mess just because of that investigation going on at the Safari Tops. If only I knew this uh, 24 hours earlier. This is Akanako Hotel, where people of utmost class and importance do come to lodge. In fact, you are constituting nuisance here, and if you are captured on a CCTV camera, you are going straight to prison. Look, let me call the manager, okay? Let me just call the manager. Look, look, get to work, get to work. Um. Oh, Jesus, my credit is finished. Ow, ow, ow. Look, can you just tell the manager it's short? Hey, hey. Short, short from short torn agency, please. Short from short torn agency. Oh, Medical Medical. 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 Hey! What's happening there? Sir, some haggard looking man carrying bicycle was making his way here. And when I tried to stop him, he was insisting you have a, he, you have a contract with him. And that, um, and I threw him away, knowing fairly well that we don't, we don't do business with such people. So, um, where is he now? Uh, he must have gone, or maybe hanging around. He said his name was uh, Sean, and, and that he is from one agency or something. That he is, he is coming to take our important guest out. Jesus Christ. Uh -huh. uh, uh, where is he? Uh -huh. That is where I realized he had a mental problem. And I threw him out. Christ. Let's go and check. Sean? You lied in your proposal, which I forgive you for. Because we all lie once a while in, uh, in marketing. I expected to see you in a state-of-the-art automobile coming from a prospering agency, not with a broken-down bicycle drenched in sweat and smelling like a he-goat. How do you expect to satisfy the taste of our noble, distinguished guest? Sir, a trial will convince you, okay? I know the most exotic places and, and, and the country's history is in my palm. Please, I am the right man for this job. I need this job. Please, let me do this. I beg you. I'm sorry, Sean. I'm sorry. Our guest is not a type that we can use for an experiment or a gamble. Look, I swore to her father, the king of Hyana, that I will guarantee her safety and happiness. Your agency has no roots and it does not have what it takes. Look, she will even throw up on seeing you. Look, Sean, this is no ghetto business. Look, we need a more reputable agency to handle this business. Excuse me. Say, 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 say. You say she's from Hyana, right? All right. What about showing her the grave of Assem Agidi? 
the great warrior and hunter whose generation can be traced to Hyana, and whose grave lies in the only land I inherited from my father. Sean? Are you real? It looks like you are real. Look, her father talked about the same thing. Except that he said no historian has been able to trace it. <laughs> Sir, I'm a walking history encyclopedia. I know much more than those in air-conditioned offices and in cars. I just haven't had the chance. Please. Maybe this is just not my time. If you need me, you can call me. Uh, please, don't, don't go. Don't, don't go. Please, please, come, come, come. come. Don't go. Uh, Lisa, uh, call James. Let him take him up to the washroom and clean him up. I'll go to my room and get some new clothes from my wardrobe. Yeah. <laughs> Sean, we are game. <laughs> we are game. We are game. <laughs> present to you the man who knows this town and country like the palm of his hand. The moving history encyclopedia. The man who is going to be your tour guide. Mr. Sean Mensah. Sean, our distinguished guests. Princess Latifa of Hyana. The lady who is going to be married and crowned the queen of Hyana in just a couple of days. The lady who thought it wise to visit the land of her ancestors and receive its blessings. The queen whose glorious reign the people of Hyana await. It will be my pleasure to enhance your leisure, my beautiful lady. I'm honored. The honor is mine. I'll be privileged to serve you. So where do we go from here, Sean? Well, there are a lot of places in mind. Hence, there's no time. I will say all of them in the car, but it all depends on my lady's destination of choice. To the limo then, to the limo. Yes, I'm with the guest, then we're in the middle of a show. What show? You're in a show with her already? As a performance, she's been entertained by a flutist. Thank God. <laughs> I hope everything is going on well. Oh, it's, it's, it's going fine. You know, of all the places I suggested, she chose the house of Damba, a local flutist. You know his flute scares away the evil spirit. Okay, I wish you all the best, and I... I... You what? Never mind. Um, I'll tell you at the perfect time. Okay? Talk to you later. Goodbye. Shit, shit. Just couldn't say I love you. Hello, Your Highness. 
you can wire the money in the morning. Look, you can call her and confirm. I am making sure she's having the best time of her life. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir, Your Highness. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So I'm going to tell you a story about Kwe Kwan and see. Okay. Kwe Kwan and was a spider. So it was like, was he climbing on top of the wall? Like, exactly. Yes. Was it you? <laughs> Why did you keep me waiting this long? Um, I stopped by the shopping mall to get this. It's um... No, I have to go now. Uh, 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 wait, uh, are you not going to open it and see what's inside? No, I'm already late. The lady's waiting. Oh, please just wait a second. Open it before... so unique. I feel so at home here, like I belong, you know. I, it's like I've been here all my life and known you all my life. You know, they say home is where the heart is and I can't wait to see more. I know the tour guide must be waiting for us now. So this is Accra. Accra is mainly inhabited by the Gan people. Now the Gan people are believed to have migrated from western Nigeria, a place called Ileife. Now the early tribesmen were normally fishermen and they lived by the coast. Now because of urban modernization and because Accra is the gateway to Africa, 
it is now being inhabited by people from all walks of life and from different cultures. That's, that's beautiful. You know, the people here are so full of smiles. Yes, because there's a saying here that goes, you have to happy yourself. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Meaning? Meaning, no matter the difficulties they are going through, you still have to make yourself happy. True. Difficulty is everywhere, even in America or Europe it's, or any other part of the world. The richest men are still in pursuit of happiness and they are still working, are they not? Well, I'm still working because I am that man. <laughs> okay, uh <-huh. laughs> This forest is very significant to the history of the city. Now, if you're of the Christian faith, it is believed that whatever you ask God here, he can and he will answer you. How? It is believed that the angels live on trees and the trees have ears. So whatever you ask God, the angels will directly convey it to the Almighty because there are no buildings to obstruct the message. And it works? Of course. It is also believed that some certain African presidents come here to pray before winning elections. Mm. You know, I do have a wish on my own that I want God to grant to me. Really? Yeah. That's one of the reasons why I came here in the first place. Not to just pay homage. Right. Um, okay. You see that corner over there? You can go there and spend time with your maker. Anything you ask him, I'm very sure he's going to answer you. We'll be here with you. You know what? Let them stay behind. Come with me. Stay behind. There is something about that guy that I don't trust. We have to keep a watchful eye on him. This is wrong. We can't just let it go along. Let's just watch it. No, 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 my lady, you can't sit down, please. There might be dangerous insects on the ground, please. Just sit by my side. No, my, I'm afraid I can't. Let me look for a chair. Do I look fragile to you? When you look at me, what do you see? Sean, I'm a strong African woman. I am just high knees because the slave masters came and took my forefathers away against their will. You're a noble princess and a queen in waiting. You have to return to the future king safe and sound. Before I was given this job, I was made to sign that not even a scratch should affect your body. Come sit down. If I was following everything that I was told, I don't think I'll be here in the first place. Sit, Sean. <sighs> so, what do you think I should ask God in the first place over here? Oh my queen, I don't know what your desires are. You make a choice for me, Sean. I can't because I don't know what your desire is. What are your desires? My queen, I can't begin to tell you now. Besides, we have to go to Cape Coast Castle. You know it's far from Accra. 
and we have to be back early so that we rest and then... Forget about Cape Coast and the slave castle, Sean. I've read enough books about them and I've seen a lot of pictures. I may decide to visit or not. I just enjoy talking to you. A real man, a real African. So, tell me, what are your desires? I want to know everything. Go on, tell me. Uh, um, I... Uh... Come closer to me, I can't hear you. Um, when you said you were coming here, I thought she needed help. How did you get past my security men? There was no security. And maybe I used a different entrance. I'll leave if you don't need me. My lady, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Who is she, Sean? She's just Wendy, my secretary. She's in love with you. I can see it in her eyes. No, there's absolutely nothing going on between us. We've not even thought about it. You know what? Take me to my hotel. No, no, no. My lady, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if the intrusion angered you. But please, if I don't get to do this job very well, I don't get paid. And if I don't get paid, I don't get to put food on my table. Please, please, my lady. Please, I need to do this job very well. I beg, I need to do it. Please, I beg. I'm done, Sean. When you're ready with your story, you know where to find me. My lady. My lady. My lady. Taking on how to write this kind of letter to Ajua. <laughs> now I have a perfect letter in perfect English. I just love. Hey! It's even couple with perfume. Hey! I will be happy. Yeah, I go. I draw. This one for better, for worse. Ah, worse. What's this? An enemy. Good. For better, for good. Listen, you warrior sons, I'm gonna kill you. Go ahead and kill me. Go ahead and kill me. If it wasn't for me, would you have had this chance in the first place? I'm not going to allow her to have you, Sean. She better watch it. Who have me? What are you talking about? Are you okay? I saw it in her eyes. Her attitude, everything about her shows that she likes you. You don't even call me to tell me you have read the thing I wrote for you in the card. I waited to tell you today that's your birthday. Today's my birthday. Oh, and I forgot. What did you write to Wendy? You are the brightest star I have ever seen in the sky. You are more than just a boss to me. You are the dream I dream. The sun that shines through my day. On this special day of your life, I want to tell you that I am madly in love with you and will love to spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs> What happened? Sir, I don't hmm? know why I, I was saying she decided to come here. I, I don't know what, but... But what? But what? Look, if you blow my chances of making $50,000 from them in five days, I will throw you into jail. 
Sir, so don't worry. I am on track, okay? You better be. You better be. I want to build my own hotel. And that is my desire. Talking about desires, what is even my own desire? So are you ready to tell me what your desires are? Do I even know? Today is my birthday and I didn't even know. How I desire I can have somebody who will be there for me while I struggle in life to make other people happy. S somebody who will be there to organize my life and remind me of the things that really matter. Hmm. What a desire. <laughs> yeah. So what about money, wealth, power, women? The things that make the world go round? Latifa, I'm working on how to put smiles on people's faces so as to put food on my table. I hope to make a steady growth in life. And I hope that one day, I'll be able to go to sleep not thinking about what to eat the next day. Would you be satisfied with just that? What could be more satisfying than that in life, my queen? What about a leap? A leap to where? To the top, Sean. Life is a gradual process, my queen. Does everyone in Africa think and behave the way you do? I only know of myself. My queen. I want you to come and sit close to me. Look me in the eyes and tell me what you need to realize all that you've ever wanted in life. Closer. Closer. Hello? Hello, Wendy. Where are you? Yes. With who? With her? Okay, okay, there's a problem. You need to leave whatever you're doing right now and come to your house. Yes, there's fire in your house. What? It's actually in the next house and from, from the look of things, if you don't take care, it may get into your house. Okay, okay, but... I'm sorry, I have to go. Why? That's why I'm here, man. What kind of nonsense games did you just play? When I called you, it was past 10 and you were still with her. What did you want me to do? What exactly is wrong with you? Love is wrong with me. Love is wrong with me. I've been doing everything possible, waiting for you to notice it. I waited to tell you on your birthday. But instead of spending time with me, you were with her. I'm not going to allow anyone to buy you off with your money. Because I'm so madly, unconditionally, genuinely in love with you. Listen, Wendy, I appreciate everything you've done for me, but please, just bury your emotions. I'm a young man trying to survive. This job is very good for me. I'm getting good money from it. And with that, it's going to open more doors for me. So please, don't do anything to ruin it. Okay, okay. Please, so far as you don't mix business with pleasure. In the movies, I've seen both women buy off handsome men like you with their money. And so far as that doesn't happen with you, I'm okay, I'm fine. And I'm going to be fine if it doesn't. Okay, please. Here is your check for $500. The balance of $300 will be given you 
when you complete the tour. Um, she's told me that she's very happy with you so far. Her continuous happiness is what will make me hit the jackpot. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. I, I, I hope when she's gone, you'll be calling me for more jobs because a hit hundred dollars in less than a week, it's like a fortune. Very soon, it will begin to look like money you used to buy chewing gum. Just make sure you keep her happy and don't do anything to jeopardize my chances. As long as you don't kick the ball over the bar, I will continue passing it to you. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. <laughs> We will be going to the Ebri Botanical Gardens today. I know, yes. I know. <laughs> Good luck, boy. Thank you. Lifted my soul, lifted my soul. The way you love for me is killing me slow. Killing me slow. Be my queen, and I will wear the crown. Crown. You and me forever. Good morning, my queen. From now onwards, simply call me Latifa. Good morning, Latifa. If we don't start heading to Ibri now, it might start raining without notice. So what happened to you last night? Oh, it was nothing. It was just a stupid game pulled up by my secretary. And you gave her the fuck she wanted? I beg your pardon? Pardon my language. What I meant to say is she pulled you away from me and she spent the night with you? Look, I've never slept with any woman in my life. I don't intend to start, at least not with my secretary. Mm, nice to hear. So do you expect me to believe something like that? That what? A handsome man of your age has no common knowledge of a woman's body. Really? Come on boy, you know you can do better than that. Latifa, if it would please you, I'll take my leave now. I'll be waiting for you outside, please hurry up. You know what will please me? A massage. Very well, then I will inform the hotel manager. They have a world-class spa here. No. I have a special oil that I use and I want you to give me the massage I want. I have no knowledge of that. I'm just a tour guide. Well, I'll teach you that more. Yes, um, yes, I, I'm rushing down to get a massage therapist. But she had a massage last night. Besides, she told us that one of her aides is a specialist and therefore she will not need our services in that direction anymore. Oh, um, yes, but she changed her mind. Sean. Yes, sir. Sean? Sir, I, you can even go inside and check. Okay. Wait. She was half naked. Was she like that when you left her? No, 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 sir. No. She was. Sean, yes, I would like to see you in my office right now. Come on. Yes, Gary. Listen, can I call you later? I'm in the middle of something right now. I gave you the chance of your life and you are blowing it away. Trust me, sir, I didn't do anything. Look, I have been in this job for 18 good years and I've seen women of high class fall in love with butlers and housekeepers, not to talk about a charming young man like you. Why did you have to do this, Sean? Why? Look, her father, the king, told me that she's a virgin at her age and will have to return a virgin and marry her husband a virgin according to their tradition. Why did you have to do it? 
Why? What about my jackpot? Why? Why, Sean? I swear I did not do anything. I don't even know what to do, even if I had to do it. I, 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 Shut up, you fool! It is preposterous to mix business with pleasure. Both don't go! Fool! Did you believe me if I told you this? Look, I don't care. I don't want to believe anything. I won't believe anything you say. I should have known that nothing good will come out of Babylon. You, you go out of my way. Go! You are you are fired! Go out! Go out! Go out! Go out. Why did you guys call me? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry, okay? I'm sorry. I, I'm still a virgin. Huh? You see, my dream was to be a reverend father. But, but my father kicked against the idea because I was the only child. So he took me from the seminary and he enrolled me in the university. Up until this moment, I used to think that the reason why I was not able to make it in life might be connected with my refusal to serve God through priesthood. Are you serious, Yon? I've never slept with a woman before. Since I didn't realize my initial dream, I fell in love with nature and history. That, that's how I find myself here. Sorry for calling you an idiot. Mr. Manager. I don't want to be disturbed, right? So, um, when I'm ready to go out, I'll let you know. agency to handle this business. Excuse me. Oh, lady, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if the intrusion angered you, but please, if I don't get to do this job very well, I don't get paid. And if I don't get paid, I don't get to put food on my table. Please, please, my lady, please. I need to do this job very well. I beg, I need to do it. Please, I beg. I'm done, Sean. When you're ready with your story, you know where to find me. My lady. Everything possible, waiting for you to notice it. I waited to tell you on your birthday, but instead of spending time with me, you're with her. Look, her father, the king, told me that she's a virgin at her age, and we have to return a virgin and marry her husband a virgin according to their tradition. God, why must I encounter obstacles everywhere I go? If my refusal to be a priest is connected with this, please. Please forgive me, Father. All I want is to work and earn a decent living through my work. Father, I beg you, see me through all this. You took over from James this morning, right? Yes, sir. You know, I have been calling his phone the whole morning and uh, it's not going through. Uh, did he tell you anything about our guest from Hyana this morning before he left? No sir, he didn't. And you see, I've been calling her room and her mobile number and she's not picking any of them. Yes, yeah, sir, the kitchen also reported they did not take their breakfast. Jesus Christ. Um, is Sean around? Yes, sir. He's waiting at the reception. Look, tell him to see me now. Now, now, now.
we should have eaten if she refused to eat. Now my stomach is on fire. Look at you. Aren't she the one pledging heaven and earth to head away one family? If she's happy, all of us should be. If she's sad, all of us should be. That is what love and togetherness is all about. <laughs> It is obvious, Sean. That girl wants to fuck you. But don't fuck with my dreams. Sir, but I... I mean... Look, go and screw that lady. What? Maybe she would prefer that to... go into Kakum, Ebury Gardens, Elmina Castle, or even the irresistible Kwau Mountains. Sir, but... Go do your job, son. This will not be the first time a lady will fly 10,600 miles just to come and have a fuck here. No. Look, I presume both of you are virgins and if you need help, I can assist you with some videos on sex for first timers. Anything that will make her father pay me my money is what I will do. Go, son. Say, say, I, I, I can't do it. I'm sorry. I can't. Go, go. Say, oh, please. Say, please just hear me out. Okay? Look, son. Say. Oh. How did you know my buddy was calling you? I need to speak to you. I'm at your service. I learnt your mission here was to visit the land of your ancestors and historical places and also visit the grave of the man believed to be your great-grandfather whose history can be traced to Hyana where you come from. You're right. I also learnt that you must marry the future king, your husband, as a virgin, as it is customary in your kingdom. Well, that's what they've been telling me for the past 28 years. Are you trying to tell me that's not what it is? No. I am trying to tell you that I am willing to desecrate this tradition just for you. Meaning? Meaning you're wasting a lot of your time. Sean, I want you to make love to me. Listen, I'm a well-traveled girl. In all the countries I have been to, I have never met anyone that is so endearing, that is so refreshing and vibrant like you. Not in Asia or the Caribbean state or Europe. Not even the king in waiting, my fiancé. But you, here in Africa. You are going to get married to a man you've known all your life and you are going to do so in a few weeks time. I have never dated nor tasted a woman in my life. So I don't think touching another man's wife is right, let alone see her naked. I allowed you to see me naked. I know coming here will yield my desired results, but maybe it was to meet you, Sean, right there in the forest of prayers, where you told me that my prayers and my wishes could be answered. 
And over there, I just wanted you to hold me and kiss me and make love to me. I wanted to be lost with the most handsome man that I've ever seen in my life. You know, sometimes our forefathers have a way of bringing what is theirs back home. Look, I just want to complete my job. Get paid so that you can return to your father the king and your husband and the throne. I'll be waiting for you outside. Sean! If you leave, this will be the last thing you ever see me. Atifa, please. Don't please me. It's either you're going to school me or leave this place. Look, it hasn't come to that. Okay? Please, just let us go. I want you to visit all those memorable places before you return. I want to make everybody happy and I don't want to ruin anybody's business. What? what are you a coward or you're gay? Admit it, you can't handle a woman. Say it! Go on! You know, by dawn I'll be... Leave this place! By dawn I'll be gone! Latifa, look, I'm sorry, Latifa. Okay, I'm... I'm sorry. Don't pick up the call. Where are you, my I said, don't pick up the damn call. Hello? Don't pick the damn call. That is very important. Hello? Yes? What, they're shutting down the office? Okay, you know what? I'm coming there right now. I'm going to give them money, okay? Okay. All right, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, bye. Sean, you are not leaving here until we make love. Call it madness, call it insanity, call it infatuation, call it lust, call it whatever you want to call it. You're going to make love to me. I want it and I want it now. I am not kidding. I'm serious. Don't say a word. Oh, your highness. Ah. She's having a very good time here. <laughs> Look, she's been to a lot of places. So many places you cannot even imagine. <laughs> oh yes, of course. Of course. Oh, the money. <laughs> I, re I just received the alert. <laughs> Your Highness. Look, as I'm speaking to you now, she is touring a very historic site. <laughs> oh, of course, of course. <laughs> She will return intact, very intact. <laughs> of course. The balance. Tomorrow. <laughs> oh, Your Highness. Merci beaucoup. <laughs> that is. <laughs> thank you very much in French. <laughs> Your Highness, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Your Highness. <laughs> okay. Bye bye, Your Highness. Bye bye. So if this is all what sex is about, why do people immense themselves deeply into it? Sean, darling, I'm sure after a while you and I will actually start to enjoy it. Know our bodies very well. You and who? You and I, of course. Because the fun is just beginning. Look, I did this just to please you. And whatever I wanted to achieve, I hope you've achieved it. Sean, you're a real man. I love your warmth and your energy. I love your body smell. I love the way you make me laugh. I love everything about you. Look, I'll be at the reception. My office must have been closed down by now. I think you'll be needing this. Maybe after now your office will now turn to look like a kiosk. What is this? Open it when you get home. I'll be waiting for you downstairs. I will surely be with you, darling. How did it go? 
Just the way you wanted it. Oh, don't tell me you are not enthralled devouring a whole princess, the future queen of Hyana, for free. Look, you have to be indebted to me over this for life. I am thinking about quitting today. This is not the reason I took the job. Why? Sure. Okay, okay. I'll increase the fee we agreed. Mm, just stay around and make her happy until she leaves. Sir, my dream is to sell my country through its stories and endowments and tell its history. Not to be turned into a gigolo. Oh, no, 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 Sean. It is not like that. It's not like that. See, things happen. I'm yeah, sorry. I'm with it. But I just have to quit now. Sean. Sure. He had an emergency and I had to see him off, but don't, don't worry. He will be back soon, and, uh, but I suggest you stay indoors until he returns. But he told me he'll be here a few minutes ago waiting. What happened? Uh, nothing, but uh, he had a call. Who called? I don't know, but whatever it is, it was very urgent. You know what? Take me to where he is right now. You guys should stay in. I'll go with Mr. Manager alone. Please, my lady. We can't leave you to move about alone. I'll be fine. Mr. Manager, let's go. We can take any small car apart from the limo. Oh, can I suggest... Oh, madam, can I suggest... The problem is, I don't know which direction in which to go looking for him. If we don't find him right now, I will call my father and tell him I've been lying all along. Oh, no, 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 uh, no, 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 please, uh, we must find him. We must find him. told me that he lives somewhere around here, but uh, you may find the environment somewhat... Uh, you may just not like the environment. I don't care where he lives, just take me to him now. Okay. That looks like his bike. Chase after him! Stop! Hey, hey stop! I don't think we should have allowed her to go alone for any reason. Though we have stubborn chicken bees sometimes. Remember she did the same thing in Brazil? And let her return on after walking out on the fiancé grave. I don't sincerely think she would truly love that guy. What do you think? Look, I feel sh she got some interest in that poor guy. Hell no way! You should have told me earlier that I would have given you more money than you expected from my father. Now how do I get him back? Well, you see, it is quite late now, so um, let's go back. Um,
So her love for me is real. So she would have still given me the ten thousand dollars even if I didn't sleep with her. But God, God, God I, 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 am I being unfair to her? No. This lady and I have no future together. She's a queen. I'm a, I'm a papa. God. First time that I that I saw you, my heart skipped a beat. And after today, when I felt you inside me, Sean, it consummated the whole feeling. Sean, I love you. I am crazy about you. But I can't. Shh, please. All the worries in my life I let go. No more standing looking like I don't know. So this is what sex and love is all about. So this is the feeling being loved is. And being loved by a special lady makes you so special. Fat bank account. Heavy wardrobe and a new abode in a hotel room. God bless the day I met you. Queen Latifah. You and me forever, we shall shine, shine. I am for you, you are for me. Nothing else can come in between. I have found love, I have found you, you are all. So, this is where she's been hiding, you know? How did you locate this place? Same way I locate it. my way into your heart. And you throw it in the bed. Wendy, nothing ever existed between you and I. We really had a working relationship. You think so? I know so, and I know you know it too. Well, then everything's about to change right now. What do you mean? Here. I'm going to do whatever she did for you and even more. In that bag is $15,000. She gave me money, right? And you needed it. Well, this is my own money, and I know you'll be needing it. So take it. How the hell did you come across $15,000? I stole it. The way she stole you away from me. And now, I am here to make you mine. Sean, <laughs> open this door! Open the door! Sean, I'm not leaving you until you come out. Your Highness, I don't know. We packed all our baggage, but she cancelled everything. Sir, she is not sick. I don't know, Your Highness. All right. I'll let you know, sir. Thank you, sir. Why did you tell me you don't know? Will you tell me you don't know it is because of that strong guy? Oh, come on. She no longer sleeps in her suit, but in his place, and you say you don't know. 
And you think I should just tell His Majesty so that his skin has a life on our thing, right? Please, let's go to the room. I want to tell you something. Don't be disappointed in me, Your Highness. I know she will be getting married. Yes. Y yes, Your Highness. Oh, so, so please, uh, please, don't know. And I cannot push a, an adult and a personality like her into a plane and, and sack her from my country. No, I can't do that. Oh, Your Highness, please try to understand me. Oh, oh, understand. Oh, your, your Highness. Hello. Hello. <laughs> the young lady has tasted the forbidden fruit in the land of her ancestors. And only a miracle can make things the same as they were. Thank God. I have the money. <laughs> I have the money. Ashamed and disappointed in you. Daddy, I said I'll be coming home soon. By morning when I confirm what I'm hearing, you shall receive my email. Daddy. Hello? Daddy. Daddy. Okay, go back to your husband. I asked you a very simple question. I said, where the hell is he, you bitch? Come here. Oh, baby. I've been hiding in the bathroom since yesterday when she came in. You! I came to show you this. I did this because I love you. I did all of this because I love you. And now this? Don't you dare touch me! You know what? I am going. This is all you've ever wanted. I have done nothing, Sean. I have done nothing but to show you true love. All I ever wanted was to be with you. Shit. And now look. You know what? Do whatever you want. Be with whoever you want to be with. I don't even want to hear from you again. It's just, I'm going. Don't, please, don't talk. Please, don't. God. Don't. Let, let's go. Let go of me. Let's go, please. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, what a wonderful day. <laughs> My dreams have finally come to pass. Oh, darling. Go and join your father in his grave. <laughs>
'cause I feel it. That love will find a way. It will find the way to get to me. I will open, open up the door. I'll be listening. Latifa, four days without you has been like four years. Please write to me. Tell me you're okay. I never knew how much I loved you till you were gone. I love you. And I won't mind walking all the way to Hayana just to show how much I love you. Sweetie, hey. I, um, I checked the calendar at the registry and 20th will be free for our wedding. You and whose wedding? Until you stop dreaming, you will not stop getting sick. Lock my door when you're done waiting. I love you. And now this? Don't you dare touch me! Dare touch me! You know what? I am going! going. I am going! This is all you've ever wanted! You've ever wanted. All you've ever wanted. I have done nothing! I have done nothing! I have done nothing! I have done nothing! But true love! True love! True love! All I ever wanted was to want with you! I'm crazy about you! You're going to make love to me. I want it and I want it now. I is it not, I am not. Is it Is it destiny? Is it something, something in me? Cause I feel it, that love will find a way. It will find the way to get to me. I will open, open up the door. I'll be listening, even in my sleep. Surprised as to how you managed to locate this place. Ah, let us talk about that first. Now I know we have arrived. Indeed, I didn't know Konongun to Accra was this far. It is, especially when it's your first time being here. Anyway, how are you, my son? Very well, thank you, Wafa. That's good to know. Okay, now let's go straight to the reason why we are here. It is getting dark, and as you know, we must go back to Konongun. What is it? The lady that showed us here told us how she helped you become what you are today, yet you abandoned her. Who? Wendy, your woman. She came to Konongo crying. She was saying all sorts of things. She said she helped you become what you are today, yet you chose to abandon her. She spent two days, and from what we saw, no city girl of this age is as hardworking as she is. Well, if I don't believe anything she says, Things might not be the way she painted it. Our son, you are the only surviving child of our brother Mensah Peku. We don't care about anything than you hurrying up and marrying that girl and sustaining your lineage. 
we've already set a date with Wendy and her people for the traditional rites this Saturday. And the court wedding, she told us, is on the 20th. So we have announced to the whole of Konongo, men, women, children, elders, and they are warming up. But Uncle, this is not fair. You should have consulted me first before going ahead. He has told us how stubborn you've become. You must marry that girl. You must marry that girl. Otherwise, we'll go and marry her for you and bring her here. And if we don't see you in court on 20th, we'll go and bring the whole of Konongo to come here until you agree to marry her and continue your lineage. Exactly. We can't be alive and see your lineage extinct when you are healthy. Never! Never! Let's go. We are going, but we'll be back here. We'll be back here on, on, on Friday. And for me, you don't go. Wafa, Wafa, listen. Wafa, let's talk about it. Wafa, Wafa. Let's go. 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 Sean, what a surprise. So you finished with your chicken? I'm very sorry. I'm just trying as much as possible to make myself happy. That is too short. But why are you so moody? Sir, has she called you since she left? Oh, they seized every communication gadget from her that day. The number with which her father used to contact me is not going to. As for her, I don't have a number. I never knew how much she meant to me till she was gone. Come on, Sean. You made over forty thousand dollars from her. She sold all the gold she came with. Added it to what the money she had and gave it to you. I made only twenty thousand dollars out of my fifty thousand target. There's no reason why you should be moody. Just go and settle down with your girl, Wendy. And go ahead. I'm crazily in love with Latifa, and I don't think I can live without her. If you can contact anybody in Hyana, tell the person to tell her. So please just return my calls or my emails. Else I'm going to go to Hyana and I'm going to be with her no matter what the consequences will be. Mm. Right. There is a map of Hyana. Right in the middle there. It's the palace where she must be living with her husband. Right beside it is the central prison built on a very large lake where they breed wild crocodiles and they feed them with criminals and intruders just as you want to be. So are you saying I'm not going to see her again? And I'll be thrown in prison if I go? Why I'm worried is, I don't know this man you want to marry, and yet it is fixed for Saturday. Why? Um, Mom, he's, he's a very, very busy person. <laughs> See, his, his job carries him abroad most of the time. And as much as he can be here, I'm sure his people will be here. Okay, he's a very, very lovely person and he loves me so much. Oh yes, I know he loves you very, very much, but at least He's supposed to be calling me as his mother-in-law. Okay, okay. I'm gonna make sure you talk to him the next time he calls, I promise. That's good. <laughs> okay, so can I go to bed now? Okay, why not? All right, good night. Good night. Latifa, darling, 
I know you are enjoying your marriage and coronation by now. But I'm in pain. The pain you created by allowing me to taste your womanhood and making me fall in love with you. Now I'm in limbo and about to marry the woman that says she loves me that I never loved. You did your father's wish by marrying Grey and I'm also going to do my own uncle's wish by marrying Wendy and sustain my lineage. I know you will not reply this as usual, but on the 20th, I'm going to be tied to Wendy and I'll live the rest of my life in pain knowing that I can never love any woman like I loved you. I'm fine. I'm so excited. <laughs> yes. Tomorrow. It's tomorrow. I just called you to, to remind you that you should be there tomorrow because tomorrow is a very big day for me, okay? <laughs> yes. I'm at the salon. I'm fixing my hair. Yeah. Okay. See you tomorrow. I'm going to call the other girls and tell them right now. Okay. Bye. Hey, Nancy. Yeah, I'm at the salon fixing my hair. Yes, don't forget about tomorrow, okay? Tomorrow is a big day for me. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, everything is ready, everything is good, everything is fine. Just be there, all right? Yeah, yeah, I've called the other girls already. <laughs> they all be there, yeah. <laughs> okay, see you tomorrow, bye. <laughs> no, no, wait, before you say anything else, let me just remind you about tomorrow. Make sure you come there. Yes, same time, nothing has changed, everything is on point. <laughs> yeah, yes, so happy. <laughs> okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, as there's no impediment to this marriage, um, let's go ahead and formally get it registered. Sorry, Wendy, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, my daughter. It's okay. Hmm? Gosh. I missed you like crazy. You did a crazy thing by wanting to marry a man who does not love you. I'm crazy about you. What happened? <laughs> I thought I had him and he was gone. I should 
Well, I got your mail and your date. I had to come and stop the wedding. My father is alive and he's well. I had to run away just to be with you. Sean, I have forsaken everything. The crown. The affluence, the wealth my celebrity status, everything, just so I can be with you. I love it this way. It's simple, hmm. and quiet. <clears throat> I never knew how much I loved you till you left. I would have given up everything you gave me just to show how much I love you. I know. Mm. I know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, come on. I missed everything about you. Mm. Yes, you did. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I don't know what you are talking about. I am just a simple man uh, trying to survive. Please, who are you? I am Grey, the king of Hyena in waiting. I was told you plotted everything that happened to my wife here. Uh, I know nothing. Good, do you know what that has cost me? That act is the reason why I am not here to the king. I, I know nothing, I, I swear. My wife is in this country. Where the hell are you keeping her? She went the same way she came in. I saw her enter the plane and that was the last time I saw her. Please, I do not know whether she's back into the country. Please, I can take you around the whole hotel. She's not lodging here. Tell me where that lunatic Sean lives. Um, Shh! Because they please, I don't know where he is. No, it's true. Um, his his girlfriend came to leave an invitation for me to their traditional marriage. Um, I can show you the, the, to the address on the card. Please, can I show you? Please, don't push that thing. See, he's here. You see, you can, give it, you can check his name. He's here. Bring this idiot. You're not scared. 
You charmed my wife? You screwing and extorting money from her? I thought you were some kind of superman or something. I never knew you were just an ordinary chaff. Great, get out of here now! Oh, what? You fool! Did you just call me a fool? Who the hell do you think you are? Who made you? I have never loved you, fool. Since I discovered you murdered and raped your father's maid and buried her in the bush. I have despised you since. And I assure you that you have a lot of explaining to do with the police. You're just ranting out of the champ he used to turn your brain. You don't even know what you're saying. You don't have the proof, do you? You think so? Do you really think so? Her body was exhumed and the forensics are at work. I personally reported to the police. And your accomplice who told us a month ago showed us the scene and is helping the police with the investigation. This is your ploy just to leave me and be with this idiot, right? You are mine. Even as a murderer, you were still with me. You were supposed to be my queen, if not for the father you came to Africa and he charmed you. But that's the reason I came here in the first place. To think and know what's good for me. And thank God he answered my prayers. Because I wouldn't have met Sean. I was only with you because I wanted to keep my father's wishes. And what? Keep the heritage of Hyena. But what about me? Huh? Gray. What about me? What about how I feel? My feelings? My heart? You are such an arrogant idiot. And you will go to jail. Arrogant idiot. You wanna mess with me, huh? You're messing with me. Be prepared for war. The two of you. Be prepared for war. We can't go back to the house now. It's been destroyed and the people are on our trail. What do we do? Listen, Sean. Gray and his rogues are criminals and they deserve to be in jail. So there's nothing for you to worry about. Okay, so what lies ahead of us now? Good things! Good things in the midst of this? <sighs> Listen, Sean, I am going to be the Queen of Hyena. And you are going to be the next King of Hyena. Can you just stop the jokes? I'm thinking about where we are going and how we are going to get there and how we are going to be safe and you're talking about... My father called me this morning and he told me that the police have declared Gray and his rogues wanted. And the Hyenese police have already called their Ghanaian counterparts and they're on their trail. And he doesn't even know it. You know, finding someone like this can sometimes be very, very difficult. But can be very easy. You know, He's a foreigner and he doesn't know any place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, let's pray he ends up at the usual place. Since money, these guys couldn't even call me and give me good news. Where the hell in this town would they be that they couldn't even find them? Relax. Relax. They will capture them. Hmm? Speak. Sir, they escaped. We were almost caught by the police. Are you sure of what you're saying? Yes, sir. And I suggest we leave town. The police may be trailing us. So what are we going to do? Give me a minute. Okay, okay, sir. Leave this country loser. 
your man devoured my wife. And I'm going to devour you, you understand? No! No! What the fuck do you want? What do you want? Drop it! Drop your gun and surrender now! Now! Drop it! Slowly. This whole thing is turning out to be a great adventure. You don't seem bothered about this misadventure. Does anything bother you at all? It used to, but the thing is, ever since I met you, I'm at peace with myself. Peace? You find peace in the midst of this danger? Sean, I'd rather be with you in this bush than to be without you in paradise. Latifa. Our love is being threatened by an enemy. We don't even know where we are. We don't even know where we are going. We don't even know how we are going to survive it. Why are you giving up on us so fast? That's not what I'm saying. Then what are you saying? You've done so much for me, and I have a feeling you're going to give up along the line. I hope to get to my grandmother's village. I doubt if you'll be able to survive it over there. Do human beings live there? Of course. Then we can live and survive there. In fact, we can be anywhere. Just calm down, okay? Come give me a kiss. Please. Kiss. Sean, come on. There is a human presence in this bush. But certainly not them. No, it must be a hunter or bushman. So where does this fair lead us now? Tactics 21. Let's lay low with our heads high. Search for the object with precision and hit on sight. Do you think it will lead to your capture? This guy in question is described by his country police as very routine and tactical. As a foremost control leader in the army. Do you think we can apprehend him with such tactics? No, I think we should risk the guys. We can't do anything like this night. Let's search for the origin of this fire and pass the night there. Then tomorrow, we can call headquarters and then reinforce the new strategy. Let's go. <clears throat> oh, Jesus. I can't believe we escaped death by the whiskers. My heart nearly fell out. Oh, come on, Sean. Gwen and his can't harm us. Our love is pure and is made from heaven. Sean, nothing can separate us. So, come here, give me a hug. Yeah. You're really enjoying this, aren't you? Of course. <laughs> Jesus. Give me a kiss. Jesus. I said kiss me. <laughs> You see what that goddamn bitch has reduced me to? I was only interested in the power and influence that comes from the royalty of the throne. If not for my father 
how I've been in LA living my gangster life, worshiping the devil. Here am I in Africa, lost in a goddamn bush, being chased by some fucking cops. They must surely pay with their lives. That bitch and that moron, you pay with your lives. Yes, Your Highness. My men are on it. They will surely apprehend him. What of my lovely daughter? I don't want any harm to befall her, please. Yeah, as I speak to you now, Your Highness. We have intelligence that they are hiding within a sand forest area. Oh, sorry, 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 Your Highness. I've forgotten you don't know the area. But what I'm saying, where they are hiding, we have our men from north, east, and south. And 10 minutes ago, 10 minutes ago, the helicopter just left. And we solicited for the assistance of the Navy and local fishermen. There is no way he can escape. I assure you, Your Highness. If you help return my daughter safely, I promise you a reward of There's no sign of a village nearby. If we're on the right track, we should have crossed the Vimba River by now. <laughs> God bless this day, Sean. Sean, we are lost. But I'm lost with the man that I love. Lost in this forest, where the birds are singing beautiful songs. Lost away from the world and its troubles. But the man who means the world to me, the one who makes me happy, the one that I love. Big love to be. <laughs> Look, Lativa, <laughs> I no longer think you're normal. What is wrong with you? We're going to die here of hunger if we don't find a way. Look at what you're talking about. Baby, listen, there's always a way. If we can find a way to each other's hearts and love, then we can find a way to anywhere. So just stop worrying and give me a kiss. Come here. Come, give me a kiss. Make love to me. Ah! That will be in hell. I always know I will find it to you and blow out your brains. Please don't harm her, okay? I'd rather lose her to you than see anything harm her. Please, look, just, just, just shoot me. Shoot me and you can have her, please. Just, just shoot me, please. I beg you, just don't do anything to hurt her. I beg you, please. So you love this bitch this much? But you know, I still have some sense of taste in me. I would not for once touch this edible meat you've desecrated. But I will not let you go because you've humiliated and brought me to this condition. Shoot us! Do your worst! Is that all you can do? Go on! Shoot us! But when you shoot us and we die, we will still love each other, even in paradise. Who do you think you are? Go on! If you don't shoot us, you'll even be a loser. Loser! Loser! Shoot us! Shoot us! Is that all you can do? Point a gun? Pull the trigger, loser! Shut up! Pull the trigger! Do your worst! What can you do? You dare spit on me? You roast him.
try to look the less you see so now I know what love is all about I feel the glow it's burning in my heart every Yes, Your Highness. This is not beyond us. Your Highness, I'm assuring you there's no foul play anywhere here. A colonel driver just informed us that he saw a with a with a with a lover crossing the Vimpa River in the company of a hunter. Yes, Your Highness. What we are trying to do now is just to, to, to track down the hunter. Your Majesty, you know Gray was a former military officer, so tracking him down won't be all that easy. Then I am sending my chief of staff down to Accra. If you people cannot find my daughter, he will. Your Majesty, it hasn't come to that. Please give us up to tomorrow. We are trying our best so that we can... He's leaving the palace now and will be on the next available flight to Accra. Don't bother receiving him. He knows his way to everywhere in the world. Your Majesty? Okay. Hello? Hello? Love is the most sweetest thing in the world. Sweet as it is. It's the most bitter. The most dangerous. Depend on the contest surrounding it. You live here, yet you sound so educated. Love brought me here. I lost the only woman I love most. In a bizarre way. Oh, why? What happened? I was poor. The parents never wanted us to marry. In order to marry her, I went to the Middle East. I was involved in dubious activities. Eventually, I made a lot of money. But when I came back, she had killed herself. I was told the parents forced her to marry a man she didn't love. And in order not to marry him, she killed herself. I was told she would have run with me to anywhere just to be with me. So why did you come here then? I found out that life is no longer worth living again. I came to this bush to commit suicide. Another hunter rescued me and taught me how to hunt. And I decided not to go back to the city. But rather, die here in honor of her. You know, that's the power of love. So you guys should go and conquer every obstacle for the sake of your love. Thank you very much. So what do we call you? Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Th
That's the way I live here. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. I loved it. We loved it. Yeah. It was great. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Let me get this. Okay, no problem. <laughs> I am Jimmy Jones, the chief of staff to His Highness King Kebi Mambas, the king of the kingdom of Haiyana. You're welcome. I am here in reference to our queen in waiting, Latifa. I see. I was told she was dug here on her first visit. You're right. What was your role in her meeting the guy that you found her? Point of correction. The young man did not defile her. They had sex and are now in love. Sex, defilement, devouring, hammering, pondering, screwing. All I want to know is your role. Well, I only provided her with accommodation and took care of her by making her happy as demanded by His Highness, her father, the king. Can you show me the suit she stayed? With all pleasure. Dead African refused to come here. Because of this damn bitch, I came here and this is what I get. This is what I fucking got. Boss, something tells me that we still have 100% chance of claiming the throne. Once we return to Hyena, we just murder the king and you'll be installed. She lost it all when she returned to that wretched guy. Boss, if we find our way out of this bush, I suggest we disguise as women and hit the airport and back to Hyena and eliminate the king the same way we did to the girl who claimed you raped her. You guys, you guys have great plans and we're going to execute it as soon as we get back. Keep it, cause it's a good thing This is more than I can comprehend, oh more you try to look, the less you see See the road Go down there Cross the stream Follow the tiny pathway It leads to your grandmother's village okay, Thank you so much May God be with you And be with you too May your loves be stronger. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What we be will definitely be destiny. I hear you calling me destiny. I am for you. You are for me. Nothing else can come in between. I have found love. I have found you. You are all I. And we're almost there. I used to play around this area. Do you know what? I can't wait to eat the banquet and having you talk so much about. <laughs> Hello, lovebirds. Too sad your happiness is over now. Take them away. Move!
show your face or I'll kill you. You're a big fool. In fact, you're so foolish, your foolishness can't be measured. You raped and humiliated me. You were in the army. But my initial dream was to be in the army before abandoning it to work for Sean, hoping he'll fall for me. Hoping he would love me. So he never loved you, bitch. And you couldn't see that, idiot? You're so stupid. You're so stupid you couldn't see that Latifa and Sean are madly in love. Christ. I saw it the very first day I saw her looking into his eyes. I was only fighting for what I love that I have lost. And now, I've shown you my taxes that I learned in the academy. So you guys are all dead. It's the end for you guys. How can you, young girl, and these three little talks here, come against my well-trained guards and an ex-soldier? Walk away, Wendy. The person I seek to kill is that cockroach called Sean and the bitch. Not you. See, I told you these guys are funny. <laughs> in fact, you're so stupid, you couldn't even realize that I have Sean and Latifa in my custody. And when I'm done with you guys, I'll think of what to do to them next. <laughs> see? See? This is exactly what I was talking about. You guys are dumb. You guys just don't think. You're just empty bowels walking the earth. I was trailing you and I took the bullets off your guns whilst you guys slept last night. Oh yes. And I have a hand on incriminating information you had in your pocket. Please. Please. Just let us go, please. I beg of you, please. Where is it? Freeze! This is the police. Drop your weapon and go on your knees. Now! Move everybody. Now! Move, Move it! Arrested for murder and rape. Are you gonna come back with me to hide me to be the future king? We're already on our way to the airport. Anything to be with my baby. Something in me, cause I feel it, that love will find a way. It will find the way to get to me. The worries in my life I let go. let go No more standing looking like I don't know I believe nothing can stop me now, now. Even
even if the mountain come falling down, down. I am happy you uplifted my soul. The way you love for me is killing me slow. Be my queen, and I will wear the crown, crown. You and me forever, we shall shine, shine. I am for you, you are for me Nothing else can come in between I have found love, I have found you You are all I have in my world Yes I know, yes I know that love is a good thing When you find it, keep it, cause it's a good thing This is more than I can comprehend, oh the more you try to look, the less you see so Now I know what love is all about I feel the glow, it's burning in my heart Every evil on my part I say no And all the chains in my hand cannot hold What will be Will definitely be, 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 be destiny. I hear you destiny, calling me destiny. I am for you, yeah, you are for me. Nothing else can come in between. I have found love, I have found you. You are all I have in my world. As I know, as I know that love is a good thing. When you find it, keep it. Cause it's a good thing Yeah, 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 yeah All the worries in my life I let go No more standing looking like I don't know I believe nothing can stop me now even if the mountain come falling down, down I am happy you uplifted my soul